How's it going, guys? We are playing some Torchlight 2, and uh, this is my several time recording this because I was recording with Cam Studio and it just did not like me. So, right here, you get four basic classes to choose from. You either have boy or girl. And the first class is the Berserker, he's basically your melee class. The next one is the Outlander, he is your ranged damage class. I don't really know what the engineer does. I haven't really tried him out. Robots or something to fight for you. And the Ember Mage, which is what I'm going to choose because that's just your basic mage. I'm gonna make him bald. Name him C R T A. And then there's a bunch of different dogs. If you ever played Torchlight 1, all you got was either a dog or a cat, but now there's like a ferret. I don't... that thing. Cat, panther, bulldog, wolf, and a hawk. But we're gonna pick a bulldog because we want a nice loyal puppy. Make him spot professor. Let's just keep hitting random. Bowser. Winston. I like Winston. We'll play on normal. Some single player. Loading, loading, loading. I think this is as far as I can go. You should carry on to the Asterian Enclave. Asterian. Alright, we gotta go to the Asterians. Warn them. I've <laughs> done this about ten times now. So basically, if you are uh, wondering what this game's like, if you ever played Diablo, I'd more or less say it's a, like Diablo 1 or 2. Diablo 3 is just kind of like a game on its own. It's nothing like this one or the other uh, other two Diablos. This is more similar to Diablo 2 than Diablo 3. So, I don't know. If anyone's played Diablo 3, it's, I, don't, I don't really like it. I think it's kind of a crappy game, especially because it's mainly based around the blizzard trying to scam your money with their real money auction house so they patch all the items so you have to play for like 10 hours to get one good item for this is isn't and you don't even have to be online to play this so i think overall it's a lot better than diablo so that's why i'm playing this instead of a diablo playthrough leveled up let's see what we want we want a new weapon now yeah, let's get a hood I already got a new weapon, but I know there's some coming up from doing the quest a thousand times. Where's this? Oh, you can have two weapon sets. Uh... Oh, don't want that. We're gonna go... One... 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 This focus is basically your magic attack, your magic damage. Your vitality is your health. And armor and dexterity increases your critical and dodge so strength just increases your weapon damage and critical damage done for your weapons so F overall I'd rather have these three stats than strength seeing as I'm not really gonna be meleeing people much as a mage and we're gonna do electric because it's cool <laughs> And I like, that's what I've tried the last few times. I tried all of them. I like the electric one the best. Oh, I did not put the electric spell on. Though. No, what skills? Skills. Uh, there you go. And then you see how there's the two skills in the bottom. If you hit tap, you can tap between them. But as of right now, we're probably just going to use the electric one because it's kind of cool. It's kind of like if you ever played WoW, some, uh, it's like the Archon. Not Archon, Arcane Missiles. Just kind of home at targets. It's kind of cool that, uh, this is like my fifth time doing this beginning. And, uh, the map is different every time. 
I didn't think that. I thought it would just be like one basic map that you gotta follow. I didn't realize that the map would be different every time. That's kind of cool. And this bar right here, once you fill it up like this so that it has a blue sun, it gives you unlimited mana so I can just spam my spells and it increases your spell damage by 25%. And all you gotta do is to fill it up is to just use the attacks and get some. I don't, I don't know if you gotta kill them or just do damage with it, but either way. It's definitely something nice to add to the game. I just got a golden key. I don't know where to take this golden key. I don't see a chest for it anyway, so maybe it's up the road some. strength but I can complain. Uh. Well, ah, I always think when you shift click things it's gonna equip them for you but And then this right here, this is the first city you go to. Nothing too special, just a little place to stop for a minute. This is where your uh, first quest is too. I thank you for your warning, so but it has arrived too late. This have to do silence. We're gonna do the electric wand. Because, well, we're an electric mage, so <laughs> electric damage is good. And wands are pretty cool because they can cast from a distance. Whereas with the staff, you have to run up to someone to hit them. And we're just gonna go and we're gonna sell this stuff because we don't need it. I'm gonna pick up this guy's request. I don't know if you gotta activate this. I guess not. And in the fishing holes in this game, you don't need to have bait like in the other torchlight to fish. Or a fishing pole at all, you just catch stuff. It's pretty cool. And the fish, I'll try to get one. That's not a goldfish. The fish are used on your pet to transform them. Like this one will transform him into a war beast. I don't know how long it lasts, but it usually gives him like a damage bonus or something nice to it. Goldfish though are just sellable items. I have unspent. Uh oh, apparently I leveled up and didn't realize it. That's okay. I'm not like dying really fast or anything. I don't want a quest. I want that and that. Then we're gonna do this. This is um basically teleports guys away and stun you. St I mean stuns them so they can't attack you for a little bit. It's kind of nice if you have a group of mobs all slamming you at once. shows up on the mini-map like that. In 
insufficient mana. Another quest by this quest. At least all the other times I played it, there was. I guess this time might be different. What I also like is that when you break urns in this game, you can actually get items. Where in Diablo, they patched it so you can't get any items from the urns. So we're gonna clear out this map a little bit because I'm pretty sure there's another quest around somewhere. Plus we got a golden chest to get, so... Oh, and there's a chest right here. It's gonna spawn a bunch of ghosts that you gotta kill. Oh, here's the class I was looking for. Whoa. <laughs> what are you? Cast lightning spells? Me too. Alright, well you didn't have what I was looking for. I stay a war beast forever unless oh yeah two more minutes okay like man I kind of like my puppy I don't want him to be that thing forever come on I need your help so I think we're just gonna take his quest which is to kill someone in here I think once this thing loads that'll be it for this episode because I just want to make sure it's not gonna delete everything again on me and that would suck really bad so thanks for watching guys have a nice day